I'm Victor Bogado, um, and um, I decided to learn Vulcan. Uh, I'm out of job now. I decided to learn Vulcan. So did I learn it? Well, not yet. <laughs> you may ask, what did I learn? Well, this. Of course, it didn't work. Damn it. <laughs> no problem. Uh, this is supposed to be a lot of code. And this lot of code that's not there is just initialization. It's just um, initialization. So what this whole code is initializing, it's initializing an instance. It's initializing, selecting a physical device, creating a logical devices and queues, and then creating a presentation queue, which apparently it's something different, and, and then create a swap chain. And that's where I stopped on my studies. I'm not being on the studs and the, on them for too long, but one thing I should not forget to select the correct extensions, otherwise it, it doesn't work. Um, then at this point I was investigating a lot of things to discover why it wasn't working and I found this uh, API registry. It's an XML file that apparently is used to generate the headers for C and C++. Um, and I said, wow, this is great. Um, the, the headers look like this. Apparently those images are working. Um, and, uh, and you can see here, it's uh, XML with uh, command, uh, name is VK create instance. And this generates on the C++ files, this, uh, this function. And I thought, well, what else is there? So I found all the types, all platforms where Vulkan is supported, uh, defines for enable or disable platforms, all extensions, and more importantly, the dependencies between those objects. So what did I do? I started doing uh, code generation with XS. LT, uh, generating headers with enums for all the platforms, extensions, and types, and context type traits associated with those, uh, association, those, associating this, those elements. Uh, so I didn't finish everything that I planned yet. Otherwise, I would be showing much more. Um, but I, uh, my idea is to go further and create builder classes that know uh, if I'm trying to build a, a swap chain, it knows what it needs. So it can help me uh, uh, fill out all the different things that it needs and select the devices and whatever. So um, the, it, he knows what, what all, all the things that he needs and it, it helps me generate them. And we'll also automate this extension selection and who knows, it could even uh, help with uh, validation at const expert time, so compile time. So uh, that's it. The code is there on GitHub. Uh, this is my site. You can find me at Bogado uh, on Twitter or email me at victor at bogado.net. Thank you.